What's up guys, today I'm showing you this tweet called Switch R. Oxo 2 was just recently released and some developers didn't like it, the new Oxo 2. So they used the original Oxo and integrated it into iOS 7. And what you get is this. You get Switch R. They used the Oxo 2, I mean Oxo uh, idea and used it in iOS 7. Basically all you have to do is just double press twice so you can use it in the you can change it in the settings and you can swipe down or swipe up to close it or hold down on everything on one app and it closes everything if you swipe left you get the media controls here swipe another left you get the control center too and uh, you can change the control center here you all you have to do is swipe down the control center and it changes so you have them here you also have the uh, con the volume control here and you can go in the settings to change the settings of switch R so it's right here so that's basically it they integrated the uh, original OXO and put it in the iOS 7 because some people didn't like OXO 2 so they made this you can change the appearance of this so the first page can be the meteor toggles not the switcher and activation you can change the activation method and uh s developers or designers can add themes to switch r all they have to do is download the documentation on their page and that's basically it if you don't like the new oxo 2 you can get this one and i think it's better than oxo 2 truthfully and uh it's really great so remember to like and subscribe to this video and see you next time